Angie Edge, from, Angie Edge, that is, from the Wisconsin Milk Marketing Board, is here. Fall is here, so we got to switch our menus a little bit. Yeah, you can feel the little chill in the air. Mm -hmm. I think everybody's ready for chilly and warm food to warm up on those um, cool nights. Mm -hmm. Comfort food. Yeah, so we're very excited to launch our brand new online magazine that's Great Pair Share, and you can see the cover has a lot of great one, one pot meals, so you don't have to do a lot of dishes, simple to make. Hopefully, if you have a busy schedule, you can make a big pot and it'll last you a few nights, maybe. So today we have a very delicious cheesy lasagna. I know everyone likes lasagna, and this time we're making it as a soup, oh, so okay. it's a little bit easier to make. All yeah, in lasagna one takes pot. forever. I know. You got to make all those layers. <laughs> this time we're just basically putting it all in one pot and we're done. All right, what do so we have to basically, do? on the bottom of the pot, you have your sweet Italian sausage that I have here. I'm just showing the ingredients, and then one cut up um, yellow onion if you want to slice those nice and thin. Cooking those on the bottom of your pot. Then you're going to add in one can of crushed tomatoes. I'm just showing you the ingredients, mm -hmm. and uh, um, one container of chicken stock as well. So you're going to get that um, nice and broiling in your pot. So that you <laughs> get, bring that to a boil. Bring it to a boil, and then you add in your lasagna noodles and you can break them up into about one inch pieces. And I have the, the soup already prepared here, you can see. And then you're gonna add in some seasoning. So you have some fresh basil, some garlic, some red pepper flakes. And then you're probably wondering, where's the cheese at? Yeah, <laughs> so we have um, our garnishes, our cheese. So I'm gonna show you, we have um, some fresh Wisconsin mozzarella cheese that we're gonna evenly distribute into our bowls here. So on this the bottom of the bowl. on the bottom of the bowls, it makes about six servings. And then you're gonna use your um, pot here and ladle your servings out, and it's just gonna get the, the cheese to melt in the bottom of each of your containers, so there's nothing better than some melted Wisconsin cheese. The cheese at the bottom, that's a good idea. <laughs> Put that over top, but it, we're not done yet. Oh. <laughs> we're adding some more um, Parmesan to the top of it, and Wisconsin is actually the leader in award-winning Parmesan cheese. And then you can as actually put a dollop of Wisconsin ricotta cheese on top too. So three types of delicious Wisconsin cheeses. You can see I, over here I also garnished it with some fresh basil as well. So you can smell the aroma of that yeah, lasagna it smells soup. smells great. So how long do you have to cook that for? You can just cook it until the, the noodles are cooked thoroughly. You know, maybe 10 minutes on the stovetop, not a long time. So not, yeah, pretty easy. Yeah, pretty easy. Smells delicious. Oh, and I should mention there's some fresh um, spinach in there too as well as the basil. So healthy. Very healthy and a one pot meal. And it's all, all in your new online magazine. It's our new online magazine. It's called Great Pear Share. You'll notice a lot of online meals, fall harvest, um, entertaining cheese boards, more information about uh, fall harvest meals. And you got a link at eatwisconsincheese.com. Yep, you can find it at eatwisconsincheese.com. All right, lots of great recipes for the cool months yes. ahead. <laughs> it's inevitable at this yes. point. All right, Ange, great. Thank hey, you. You're going to the World Area Expo? I am. I'm going to be there the next couple days leading the fourth grade tours. Oh, enjoy. <laughs> yes, thank you.